Hello, it's Elder here, and today I want to talk to you about these minimalist dress shoes brought to you by a company called Carrots. If you've been following my work for a while, you know that I'm definitely partial to minimalist footwear. I've reviewed a plethora of minimalist shoes and uh, prefer that to integrate that into my lifestyle. If you're not familiar really with what we mean when we're talking about minimalist shoes, uh, basically two main points, and there are more, but two main points that I want to address. One is that the shoe basically from the heel to the ball of the foot has no drop. So there's no rise or even what I would call a high heel that you end up finding in most of the shoes that are out there, including running shoes, sneakers, uh, uh, whatever you want to call them, just shoes in general. So the shoes that I prefer, that would be one point is having a zero drop, all right? So you're nice and even and nice and flat with the ground, being able to get the feedback and all sorts of stuff and, and uh, good stuff that's going to help you move better in the future. And if you do have any kind of pain or discomfort, it's going to warn you and set off those sensors where if you have all this technology kind of masks all of that feedback. And now whether you're moving correctly or moving incorrectly, it's going to be that much harder to gauge because of that numbness that all of the technology on most of those shoes are causing. The other thing is a wide toe box that uh, most minimalist shoes offer, including these shoes which basically instead of your toes being all scrunched up and feeling like you're in some kind of tight bonded ice skate, these are wide and allow your toes to spread, which of course is more of a natural feel for your foot, which of course is connected to the rest of your body and uh, gives you the, uh, the proper insight onto am I moving well, am I causing pain, or am I just masking everything and then that's going to lead into even more issues in the future. Well, once again, these offer many of the benefits that I was just talking about when it comes to minimalist footwear. And let me share more of the benefits and cool features that these shoes by Carrots have to offer. As I mentioned earlier, I have uh, one heck of a collection when it comes to minimalist footwear, but I do have an issue where I don't really have an issue. My wife has an issue with them because every time we want to go to some kind of event, be it a wedding, of some type of uh, business meeting where I need to pretend that I'm grown up or even on a nice dinner where we're kind of getting dressed up to go out in town and uh, do our thing as a married couple. And uh, let's just say my wife constantly looks at me and says, okay, well, I like everything you're wearing, but your shoes, I don't know, they don't really look, they look a little too casual, like you're about to go out into the field or you're going to go to work or you're going to go hiking. And basically I'm like, yeah, because I want to be comfortable. You know, I spent all day teaching movement and trying to refine my movement. The last thing I want to do is feel uncomfortable when I'm out, and especially in a public setting. So we always had this kind of bickering, and I do have other shoes that kind of resemble dress-type shoes and are minimalist, but as far as in my wife's eyes, they don't cut it. So now when I came across these from Carrots that offered all of the benefits that I look for in a minimalist footwear, but are also approved by my wife as far as the look, I knew that I had something here. I... Uh, where I do, of course, own other fancier shoes, okay, to go out, but unfortunately, they're not minimalist. And my wife will convince me, especially for weddings or whatever, to go ahead and wear them, and I feel very awkward in them. I explain to her sometimes that I feel like a teenager wearing high heels for the first time because it's just I'm not grounded. I'm not getting the feedback that I'm used to. I'm not able to move as comfortably as, uh, as I normally am. And that doesn't really bode well, of course, for the physical aspect, let alone the me mental aspect. So coming across these, they kind of filled that whole thing because they are beautiful leather shoes. So now she's happy and I'm happy. And uh, as most of you know, that's always a good thing when it comes to marriage. These shoes, I've been wearing them for a couple weeks and are testing them out just here and there and uh, very comfortable. Once again, I feel grounded. They don't feel like the other shoes. I have to look down sometimes and say, wow, I'm actually wearing dress shoes. So as far as on all of that, it uh, passes with flying colors. Now, the one negative that people might find with these shoes, of course, is the price point. They retail for about $350 US. But once again, you get what you pay for. If you want nice, fancy leather in a good looking uh, shoe, you're going to pay that no matter what. And then the fact that these are minimalist and offer me exactly what I want, and I know a lot of people out there are also looking for the same exact thing, hopefully even you, I can justify paying that price just like I could justify paying for a, an expensive ruck you know, that I'm going to be using and isn't going to fail on me and at the same time, lasts for a long time. I can resole these shoes 
So for me, you know what? I'm going to probably have them forever because the amount of the, that, I'm, that I use like as far as getting dressed up and, and playing adult is relatively minimal. So for those few occasions a year where I'm going to get use out of these and feel comfortable and feel like myself and hopefully look good, at least in my wife's eyes, it's a, it's a sell for me. Because when I do try to opt for something a little bit more expensive, something always fails. They either fall apart, fall apart, or look cheap, or aren't comfortable. So once again, you have to pick and choose. And for me, this is an investment, and it's an investment that uh, I certainly feel comfortable with. So bottom line, if you're in the market for a really well-built, well-designed, good-looking dress shoe that offers zero drop, wide toe base, and uh, pretty much everything that we're looking for in a minimalist type shoe, certainly take a look at these shoes and their whole line by Carrots. I'm impressed. They filled a niche that I had been looking for for nearly a decade. And uh, I look forward to uh, going out on some nights on the town with the wife where well, she's happy and I'm happy and we both got what we need. Once again, this is Helder. I hope that you found this review helpful.